what's up you guys so this video is gonna be a little different I'm just gonna kind of give you a little insight about one of my flowers that I planted recently called bee bomb and some interesting facts about it as well as show you around my parents flower bed and garden because it's so beautiful <music> All right, you guys, so this is my bee bomb. And bee bomb is actually a North American native thriving flower. Um, it is found in the Carolinas. Um, the proper name for it is actually bergamot. It's kind of like a, a bergamot. It comes in a variety of um, colors. However, this is my favorite one, the red. <laughs> Um, it actually started off as a little sprout. It's in the mint family. It's a very, very great plant to have in your garden if you're into stuff like that. It actually started off as just something small, like that big, this one right here. And then it prospered to all of this. So it is quite invasive, so wherever you decide to plant it, make sure that you plant it in an area where you don't mind it spreading. But it's beautiful. Um, this is the Scarlet Bee Bomb, I believe, but it's beautiful. It attracts bees, hummingbirds, butterflies, and everything like that. It's a beautiful flower. I absolutely love it. What's interesting about bee balm is that you can actually use it for like medical reasons. It's very herbal. Um, you can brew it into tea, like the leaves. Um, however, there is a negative effect um, to some of the bee balms. As you can see on some of the leaves, it has this little white spot. Um, that can be fixed. That's just because of moisture on there. Um, I actually have to spray it with some spray. but. They actually are doing very well. Um, I think it's a beautiful flower. Um, it's one of my favorites. And also, anything that helps the environment medically is awesome. 